What's up everyone, in today's video I'm going to be showing you how I can overclock your monitor for the best performance. By overclocking you'll have much smoother gameplay, a higher refresh rate and a drastically lower input lag. This is completely free and extremely easy to use, so without further ado, let's get right into the video. So the first thing you want to do is go in your browser and type in discord.gg slash rip tweaks. After that your discord should open and you want to join the server and go to the youtube tweaks channel. Now in here you're going to see this monitor overclock and what you want to do is download this cru.zip. So basically just click download, continue to download, and you want to save it on your desktop. Now what you want to do is right click and open with Windows Explorer. Once this window pops up, you want to drag this on your desktop and then just right click and run as administrator. All right, so what you want to do here is select the monitor. Basically, if you have two monitors, three, five, I don't even know, select the monitor that you want to tweak. If you have only one, it's probably going to be automatically selected. So just pick what monitor you want to use if you have more than one. Basically, the first thing that you want to do is click on this button here that says none. This is established resolutions this basically is resolutions that you're never gonna fucking use four by three i don't even know when you're gonna be using that useless resolutions which you could disable if you want to next what you want to do is click on this extension box here and click edit now this is also the bloating basically if you never plug your pc into a tv or something else and like you never use tv resolutions what you could do is select on tv resolutions and click delete do not touch anything else i think that probably it could be useful if you want to have sound, if you want to have free sync or other features that you have on your monitor, just delete the TV ones because there's no fucking use. We can click OK and then in the standard resolutions, again, delete all. You're never going to need this. Again, we're just uploading the monitor, so just click delete all. Now, let's edit this resolution here. As you can see, it says two resolutions. One is at 144 hertz. And if you actually see this, if you click on display settings and then go into advanced display settings, as you can see, here's a bunch of resolutions. So what we're going to be doing is change them basically as you can see i have 144.013 so we're gonna click on edit and just change that up to i don't know 145 click ok then ok again and now we can restart the pc and see what we have now after restarting my pc i'm gonna right click on my desktop display settings and in advanced display settings you can see that i have 145 hertz basically we've overclocked monitor by only one hertz now we can experiment increase by one two three five but sometimes what you could do is have a black screen and you won't be able to revert it unless you connect your pc to another monitor or to a tv so basically i don't recommend this if you're on a laptop because you're gonna have to fucking find a tv to connect you just so you can revert this so i don't fucking recommend this but it's perfectly fine to do on your pc or laptop as long as you're being safe and not overclocking it by crazy amounts and again following the steps that are used in this video and that's about it guys thank you for watching this video if you have checked make sure to leave a like subscribe please let me know what the fuck you want me to record next and <laughs>